Lake Tahoe. I don't have Napa quite out of my system. Recap. So this is our final night. We're not really in Lake Tahoe. If you remember, no, what happened is we kind of, we were supposed to be in Truckee, the whole mishap. We accidentally ended up in a much better place. Twice that's happened. I know. So another well, cool know. thing about the whole RVing adventures, Stay here. what ended up being so cool is we were so upset there for a while that we couldn't get into Truckee and we didn't know where in the hell we were going to go. And then the next thing you know, we found this cute little town, Genoa, Nevada, which was the first settlement in 1851, by the way. We're trying to figure out if it was Mormon or Italian. We think Mormon. We're it's so darling. Tom's looking up the history right now, I'm sure. <laughs> what? Genoa, our little discovery. Uh, yeah. About how much we love Genoa. I mean, I it's like... It's, uh, uh, 1851. Yeah. The first town in... First settlement in, in Nevada. Nevada. Thank you. And I know the Mormons were in Las Vegas, <clears throat> but it must have been right after that or something. Yeah. yeah. So there's this cute little... And this was a Mormon town. The, yeah, right? that's yeah. right. General, yeah. yeah. So there's this cute well, little you. downtown area. Last night when we got here, we went straight to the oldest bar, Thirst Parlor. 18, as in, 1853. Thirst yep, Thirst parlor. parlor. And that was a cool bar where Skinner waxed Laura and I playing pool. Oh, shit. <gasps> Lily got hit with the sprinkler. Oh, oh no. Uh-oh. So we are sitting at our Harvest Host site at a golf course with our camping equipment outside. <laughs> but they've been very friendly here. We actually, we're, we're glamping. we stayed two nights. We, sprinklers are going on right now. I might have to run just in case. It actually turned out pretty cool. It turned out like surprisingly better than we thought. So we only had one full day in Tahoe and to discover Tahoe. So Tom and Laura, they went their separate way. We went our separate way. Mike and I took the dogs. And I'm going to say that the drive from Genoa over to South Lake Tahoe was part of the attraction. I mean, straight up, yeah. straight that down. was gorgeous. I mean, the views. Really and gorgeous. Gorgeous. That's beautiful. That is beautiful. accidentally let it out that the trail is two miles. It's actually one mile there and one mile back. It's not that big of a deal. So you can see Cascade Falls. Ella and I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> I knew I should have brought some wine. <laughs> I said we finally found the trail. And it is a very nice trail. After we had to go back to the car twice to pee to get knots out of the dog leashes, to, <laughs> what else? Oh, get a pen to fill out the fee box. Pay the money. <sighs> Pay the money. Remember our license plate. <sighs> now I can relax. Oh. 
know if there's flat or back. <laughs> no, there's not a flat trail. I wonder if we're on the wrong one. It's okay. It's so. a pretty view. I love it. Keep leading the way, buddy. Oh, Ella, now she's getting in the front. Okay. So this is the famous inspiration point. Very nice place to stop if you want to get some nice views <laughs> in shade. <laughs> <clears throat> Why you think it's funny that I know that my dog's paws are burned? They're not burned. They were just hot. It was 92 degrees up there. So we it are to be on more than that to blister the dog's feet. California 89, which is drop dead gorgeous going around Lake Tahoe. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful views. We read that the Cascade Falls Trail was supposed to be, you know, just one mile to the falls, one mile back and fairly flat and you know very easy i don't know who wrote that shit <laughs> it's not a bad hike it's it, just the dogs ella's feet was hot she's old she was struggling no so Clyde is only out. three and his little he was his paws were burning thankfully there was a very nice guy on the trail that stopped us and said listen it's getting it's going to get worse and hotter for your dogs and your dogs are black and in this white sand and in the sun there's no shade and our dogs were like literally trying to find little shade areas bless their little hearts so we turned around we brought him back into the car with many shaded water stops and we did not get to do the cascade falls hike all the way all the way we got to see the falls though we did yeah and it's it's a it's actually a really cool hike i do it if you had proper shoes too because we were wearing flip-flops and i'm wearing water shoes probably wasn't the smartest i was driving all the way around the lake and she's turned me around and making me go back because there's an ice cream <laughs> no actually we were going to reroute for almost three hours so navigation was right telling us to go back the way we came but i said the benefit is there just happens to be an ice cream parlor that i saw in route and a dog store so I can go get mushers for my dog's paws. Okay, baby. But it's a great day in Tahoe. <laughs> we actually, and we got to see Inspiration Point, which was, yep. that's a, that's a very, a must, a must stop. In Susanville, we used to go to Inspiration Point to make out with our girls. <laughs> yeah, well, you didn't make out with me at this one. What's up with that? There was people everywhere. We're going to Susanville. You're going to take me to Inspiration Point and make out with me in Susanville? I might. How many girls did you do with like that with? I bet you did a lot. I'm not telling. <laughs> Beautiful day on Lake Tahoe. No, no. I mean, we're very close, very close. It was a beautiful drive. We found a little place to have lunch um, called Riva grill on in a marina riva it was okay for me i would have preferred the little um flurry shack or snow shack where we got our ice cream which really is the best milkshake in lake tahoe we did do that later on you would prefer to have ice cream for dinner well it no we out, we Thank did you. the uh we did the we had ice cream after our hike ah. we got hot we needed ice cream yes of course yes <laughs> we, we discovered yes we discovered it why, but, why I had a salad for dinner tonight. Correct. Very yeah, I had eggplant parmesan instead. But what was really cool is we did get to drive all the way to Emerald Bay to the state park. We tried to do the hike, which we kind of we already did, told you that it was just too hot. hot. Well, we it did part of the hike. The it was too hot for the dogs. Yeah. It was mean. It was cruel. We had to back out. We did Inspiration Point. Yep. And the views at Inspiration Point were gorgeous. That It was worth... I feel like I got to see Lake Tahoe. I forgot how beautiful Lake Tahoe is. It's truly one of the most beautiful places on the planet. Yes, I, mean, I agree. I've never been anywhere that I can say is 
way Mark prettier. Twain said something about that. Mark, Mark Twain, Twain did. What did Mark Twain what say, Andy? Oh, see, I, I knew you were going to ask me. Um, okay, beauty. here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to email the quote and... Oh, okay.